We're reading Srimad Bhagavatam, Canto 1, Chapter 3, Text Number 43. 今日要讀聖經的部分,第一篇第三章第四十三節。Krishna Dharma Gyana Dibi Saha Dharma Gyana Dibi Saha Kalo Nashta Drisham Esha Kalo Nashta Drisham Esha Kalo Nashta Drisham Esha Kalo Nashta Drisham Esha Puranato Drinodrata Puranato Drinodata Puranarko Drinodata Puranarko Drinodata Krishna Swadamo Pagate Krishna Swadamo Pagate Dharma Gyan Adibisaha Dharma Gyan Kalo Nashta Drisham Esha Kalo Nasa Drisham Esha Puranarko Dunodita Puranarko Dunodita Yeah. 
Krishna Swadamo Pagate Krishna Swadamo Pagate Dharma Gyana Dibisaha Dharma Gyana Dibisaha Esha Pura narco do no dita. Krishna is what a moop. Krishna is what a moop. Kalo Nashta Drisham Mesha Pura Narco do no Dita Krishna Swadamo Pagate Dharma Gyana Dibi Saha Kalo Nashta Drisham Mesha Pura Narko Duno Dita Krishna Swadamo Pagate Dharma Gyana Dibi Saha Kalo Nashta Drisham Esha Pura Narko Duno Dita Krishna. Krishna. In Krishna's. In Krishna's. Joy Krishna. Dek. Swadama. Swadama. On a boat. On a boat. Tiki de koi so. Upagate. Upagate. Having. Having. Returned. returned. Having returned. Woi hoi yi hao. Dharma. Dharma. Religion. Jungao. Gyana. Gyana. Knowledge. Knowledge. Jisi. Adibi. Adibi. Combine together. Combine together. Get up your head. Saha. Saha. Along with. Along with you. Kalo. Kalo. In the Kali Yuga. In the Kali Yuga. Choi Kali Lindoi. Nasta Drisham Nasta Drisham Of persons who have lost their sight Of persons who have lost their sight Na se se hoi liu yuan gian de yin Esha Esha All these All these So yau zhe se Purana Arka Purana Arka the Purana, which is brilliant like the sun. The Purana, which is brilliant like the sun. Aduna. Aduna. Just now. Just now. Enjoy. Uditaha. Uditaha. Has arisen. Has arisen. Yiking sing hei loi. Translation. This Bhagavata Purana is as brilliant as the sun, and it has arisen just after the departure of Lord Krishna to his own abode, accompanied by religion, knowledge, etc. Persons who have lost their vision due to the dense darkness of ignorance in the age of Kali shall get light from this Purana. 译文：这部《薄伽梵往世书》如同光芒万丈嘅太阳，就在主 Krishna 由宗教和知识等陪伴着离开地球回他自己嘅住所后升起。在卡里年代中，因圆会嘅浓密黑暗而失去视野的人，相从这部往世书中得到光明。
purport by Srila Prabhupada. Lord Sri Krishna has his eternal dham or abode where he eternally enjoys himself with his eternal associates and paraphernalia. And his eternal abode is a manifestation of his internal energy, whereas the material world is a manifestation of his external energy. When he descends to the material world, he displays himself with all paraphernalia in his internal potency, which is called Atma Maya. In the Bhagavad Gita, the Lord says that he descends by his own potency, Atma Maya. His form, name, fame, paraphernalia, abode, etc. are not therefore creations of matter. He descends to reclaim the fallen souls and to re-establish codes of religion which are directly enacted by him. Except for God, no one can establish the principles of religion. Either he or a suitable person empowered by him can dictate the codes of religion. Real religion means to know God, our relation with him, and our duties in relation with him, and to know ultimately our destination after leaving this material body. The conditioned souls who are entrapped by the material energy hardly know all these principles of life. Most of them are like animals engaged in eating, sleeping, fearing and mating. They are mostly engaged in sense enjoyment under the pretension of religiosity, knowledge or salvation. They are still more blind in the present age of Kali or quarrel. In the Kali Yuga, the population is just a royal edition of the animals. They have nothing to do with spiritual knowledge or godly religious life. They are so blind that they cannot see anything beyond the jurisdiction of the subtle mind, intelligence and ego. But they are very much proud of their advancement in knowledge science and material prosperity. They can risk their lives to become a dog or hog just after leaving the present body, for they have completely lost sight of the ultimate aim of life. The personality of Godhead, Sri Krishna, appeared before us just a little prior to the beginning of Kali Yuga and he returned to his eternal home practically at the commencement of Kali Yuga. While he was present, he exhibited everything by his different activities. He spoke the Bhagavad Gita specifically and eradicated all pretentious principles of religiosity. And prior to his departure, from this material world, he empowered Sri Vyasadeva through Narada to compile the messages of the Srimad Bhagavatam. And thus both the Bhagavad Gita and the Srimad Bhagavatam are like torch bearers for the blind people of this age. In other words, if men in this age of Kali want to see the real light of life, they must take to these two books only and their aim of life will be fulfilled. Bhagavad Gita is the preliminary study of the Bhagavatam and Srimad Bhagavatam is the summum bonum of life, Lord Sri Krishna personified. We must therefore accept 
Srimad Bhagavatam as the direct representation of Lord Krishna. One who can see Srimad Bhagavatam can see also Lord Sri Krishna in person. They are identical. Yu Ji, Sri Krishna, Yau Ta Zigi Wing Hang Ju Sa Dam, Toy La Lai, Ta Yau Wing Hang Tong Bun, Pui Bun Jack Wing Hang Day Hang Sao Jack La Lai Tia Chai, Ta Wing Hang Ju Sa, Hai Ta Lai Jai Lang Long Jin Si, Yi Ma Ta Sai Gai Hai Hai Oi Jai Lang Long Jin Si, Tong Ta Gong Long Ma Ta Sai Gai Si, Ta Yong Ta Dik Lai Jai Lang Long, Up Ma Maya Jin Si Ta Zigi, Wa Ta Chui Sen Da Lai Tia Chai, Ji Jun Ju Jai Bok Ka Fan Gong Jong Su, Ta Pang Ta Zigi Ge Lik Long, Up Ma Maya Gong Long, 因此，他的形象、名聲、名字、聲望、個人用品、住所等，都不是物質的產物。他降臨是為了教化墮落的靈魂，重建他親自制定的宗教原則。除了神本人，沒能人能制定宗教原則。要摸笑他，要摸是他授權了的合適人選，才能制定宗教原則。真正嘅宗教意味著。了解神，了解我們與他的關係，以及在與他的關係中，我們該履行嘅責任。了解我們離開這個物質軀體後的目的地是什麼？深陷在物質能量中的受制約嘅靈魂，根本不知道所有這些生命嘅原則。大多數人像動物一樣，只知道吃、睡、恐懼和交配。他唔打對宗教知識或解脱嘅幌子從事的，幾乎全都是感官享樂的活動。特別是現在這個紛爭嘅年代，卡利年代，人們就更加愚昧無知。卡利年代，卡利年代裏嘅人只不過是更高級一些嘅動物而已。他們沒有靈性知識，從不過神性嘅宗教生活。他們是如此盲目，根本看不到任何超出精微嘅心念、智力或自我意識範疇之外的事物。但他卻，但卻為他們在知識、科技和物質繁榮方面取得嘅進步而驕傲。他們完全不知道生命嘅最終目標，因此根本不在乎去冒在離開現有嘅軀體後，會投生為狗或豬嘅生命危險。人格手神 Sri Krishna 在卡利年代將要開始前顯現在我們面前，幾乎在卡利年代一開始就返回他永恆的住所。當他在這個世界時，他通過他的各種活動展示了一切。他特別講述《薄伽梵歌》，清除了所有偽宗教原則。在他離開這個物質世界前，他通過 Narada 授權 Vyasadeva 編會編聖典《薄伽亞談》嘅信息。因此，對這個年代裏的盲目之人來說，《薄伽梵歌》和聖典《薄伽亞談》就像照明嘅火炬。換句話說，如果這個卡利年代裏的人想要看到生命中嘅真正光明，他們必須只研讀這兩本、這兩部著作，這樣才能實現他們生命的目標。《薄伽梵歌》係學習《薄伽亞談》嘅必學嘅預備課程。聖典博加亞談係生命嘅支線，聖 Krishna 嘅本人嘅化身，所以我們必須把聖典博加亞談視為是主 Krishna 嘅直接代表。能看聖典博加亞談的人，就能看到 Sri Krishna 本人，兩者沒有區別。Vancha kaupata rubyascha kripa sindu by evacha patita nam pavane bio vaishnavi bio namo nama jai shri krishna chaitanya prabhu nityananda shri advaita gadadha shri vasa de gor bhakta vinda hare krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare. So, in the very beginning of the Srimad Bhagavatam, we had the sages in the Naimisharanya forest put, putting questions to Sutta Goswami. 咁喺聖典博加談一開始嘅時候咧，就喺、是、Lakshman Rai 誒 Lakshman Rai 嘅森林嘅聖人咧，佢咧就向 Sutta Goswami 咧詢問一啲問題。They had all come to Naimisharanya to prepare for the beginning of the Kali Yuga. These saints were all coming to Naimisharanya, the forest in this area, to prepare for the Kali Yuga. And before they had come there, just before they had all gathered in Naimisharanya, 
Lord Krishna had departed from the world. 當呢班聖人咧係嚟到呢個森林之前咧，主 Krishna 已經離開咗呢個世界。And Lord Krishna's departure from the world, of course, it was a、uh, Of great concern for all the great sages and devotees. 咁咧，主 Krishna 嘅離開咧，對所有聖人啦，同埋奉獻者嚟講咧，都一個誒非常關心嘅問題。Because they understood Lord Krishna to be the personification of all religious principles. 因為咧，佢都知道咧，主 Krishna 咧就係所有宗教原則嘅人格化身。So when the sages gathered in Naimisharanya. One of the questions which they put to Sutta Goswami was, "Now that Krishna has departed from the world, where can we find the religious principles?" 咁所以呢班聖人喺那 Mission Raya 森林聚集嘅時候咧，佢其中一個向 Sutta Goswami 詢問嘅問題就係：啊，而家主 Krishna 已經離開咗呢個世界啦，我哋能夠喺邊一度揾到呢個宗教原則咧 ？And so this verse which is spoken. By Sutta Goswami, this is like an answer to this question. 咁所以咧，呢一呢一個呢一今日呢一個譯文誒呢個詩節咧，就係由 Sutta Goswami 所講述啦，就好似咧就係向呢班聖人嘅詢問嘅答案。That Lord Krishna departed from the world, and in the absence of Lord Krishna, we have the Srimad Bhagavatam. 咁當主 Krishna 離開咗呢個世界之後咧。我哋誒就有呢一個聖典博加阿談。As mentioned here in this verse, it it appeared just after the departure of Lord Krishna. 咁就好似今日嘅詩詞所講啦，就聖典博加阿談咧，就係喺主 Krishna 離開之後咧，係顯現嘅。So the the Srimad Bhagavatam is like a literal literary incarnation of Krishna. 咁所以咧，聖典博加阿談咧就好似咧。就係、是、主 Krishna 嘅文字化身。Lord Krishna appears in many different species of life。咁咧，主 Krishna 係用誒好多唔同生命品種嗰度咧係顯現。So he can also come in the form of transcendental knowledge in the form of a revealed scripture。佢亦都可以，所以咧，佢都可以以咧係一啲超然嘅誒經典啦，一啲顯現嘅經典咧嚟到呢個形象嚟到顯現。So this Srimad Bhagavatam, which is called here the Bhagavata Purana, this、uh, is meant to replace Lord Krishna. 咁所以咧，呢誒呢部聖典博加阿談咧，我哋稱為 Bhagavata Purana 咧，往世書，亦都係咧係可以咧係取代咗 Krishna 當佢離開咗之後。And anyone who is、uh, feeling the the pains of Kali Yuga, who is feeling the disturbance of Kali Yuga, then they can take shelter of the Srimad Bhagavatam. So, when people are feeling the pains of Kali Yuga, they can take shelter of the Srimad Bhagavatam. So, when people are feeling the pains of Kali Yuga, they can take shelter of the Srimad Bhagavatam. So, when people are feeling the pains of Kali Yuga, they can take shelter of the Srimad Bhagavatam. So, when people are feeling the pains of Kali Yuga, they can take shelter of the Srimad Bhagavatam. So, when people are feeling the pains of Kali Yuga, they can take shelter of the Srimad Bhagavatam. So, when people are feeling Different discussions taking place and different examples of the the supreme power. 咁在喺聖典博加阿談入邊咧，有好多非常美妙嘅事情係發生緊啦，亦都咧係有好多唔同嘅例子。So being able to deliver this transcendental knowledge. This is the task which was given to Sutta Goswami. 咁所以咧 ，Sutta Goswami 咧被賜予咧呢一個職責，就係佢咧係去將呢一個咁超然嘅知識咧係派發出去。And it, its purpose in speaking the Srimad Bhagavatam is to help people to get out of the darkness of ignorance. 咁而講述聖典博加阿談派發呢一個超然嘅知識咧嘅目的咧，就係令到人咧能夠喺愚昧嘅黑暗當中咧係走出去。Ignorance is like darkness. 咁咧，愚昧咧就好似黑暗咁樣。In the night, we are never very sure. We always feel some insecurity, especially living in a city. We will feel insecure in the darkness of night. 咁咧喺夜晚嘅時候咧，尤其是住喺城市入邊咧，我哋永遠都會感受到啲誒唔安全嘅感覺嚇，因為就係充滿咗黑暗。But in the daytime, 
when the when the sun rises in the day then light is everywhere there's not not so much fear anymore 咁咧但係當日頭嘅時候咧有太陽啦,各地各地方都有光明嘅時候咧,我就唔會覺得恐懼。So in the Chaitanya Charitamrita, it is described like that. The Krishna is like the sun and Maya is like darkness. 咁所以喺永恆永恆的主要單日經入邊咧就有呢個描述啦。Krishna咧就好似太陽啦,而呢一個誒遠會就好似黑暗咁樣。where there is sunlight, there's no darkness. And the same way where there is Krishna, then there's no darkness of ignorance, there's no Maya. Mm. So in the Kali Yuga, there's less present less the people are less pious and less religious. 咁所以呢,喺卡年代呢,人係變得冇咁有宗教心啦,同埋冇咁虔誠. But not all people. 但並唔係所有人都係咁樣. There's all you can always get some people who are pious and religious and who actually are inquisitive about life. 咁你可以揾到啲人呢,喺卡年代入邊呢,都係有宗教心啦,都係虔誠嘅,亦都呢係對呢一個人生嘅目標呢係會詢問嘅。Although Srila Prabhupada describes in the, this age of Kali, it's a very fallen time and people are, are of low character. 咁呢聖帕巴都講描述過啦,就係卡年代呢人係 they have no understanding about the higher purpose of life. They they're simply busy with the activities of the dog, eating and sleeping and mating and defending. So the Kali Yuga is a dark age. So people have to be guided and for that purpose Sukadeva Goswami was he was speaking Srimad Bhagavatam. Mm. But for the common people, common people, they're so blind, they're not able to understand the things like Srimad Bhagavatam. They're proud of their knowledge in the terms of material standards of living. And they will risk their lives for making more money. But they don't understand how they're in a dangerous situation here in the material world. Mm. So the Kali Yuga is in progress and it's a dark age. But if we go back to the previous age, if we go back to the time of the ham Hamsa, then we will realize how people engage themselves. People will go in the Kali Yuga, people will simply go to the factory and work. And they're just busy with their eating and sleeping. And they don't know about a higher purpose of life. They think just working, get some money, and enjoy. But they don't think about the real problem of life, which is Birth and death. So the Srimad Bhagavatam is to make people more aware about the goal of life. 
。咁所以聖典博家談咧，就係、是、希望令就係、是、令到人咧更加明白到咧生人生嘅目標係乜嘢。And this is why Narada empowers Vyasadeva to write the Srimad Bhagavatam. 咁所以咧，點解 Narada 咧就係授權 Vyasadeva 咧嚟到去匯編呢個聖典博家談？ The Bhagavad Gita was also written by Vyasadeva. Bhagavad Gita is hidden in the Mahabharata. 咁咧，博加梵歌其實都係由 Sri Vyasadeva 所寫嘅。博加梵歌係隱藏咗喺 Mahabharat 入邊。So Bhagavad Gita is spoken by Krishna himself. 博加梵歌係由主 Krishna 親自所講嘅。And Srimad Bhagavatam is spoken about Krishna. 咁而聖典博加阿談咧就係描述主 Krishna。So both these two books, they give light for people in the in the age of Kali. 咁所以呢兩本書咧都係將光明咧帶俾咧卡爾年代嘅人。The people just have to be willing to hear. 咁人只需要咧係願意去聆聽。If they will hear about the message of Godhead, they can understand some higher purpose of life. 如果我哋去聆聽神嘅信息嘅話咧，佢哋就能夠明白到人生更高階嘅目標係乜嘢。And there are different scriptures. There are different traditions. They're each presenting some understanding of a higher purpose of life. 咁我哋好多唔同嘅经典啦，唔同嘅著作啦，佢都系描述咧人生高阶嘅目标系乜嘢。But the highest of all philosophies is given here in Srimad Bhagavatam. 但系咧呢个最高阶嘅目标咧就系喺圣典博加坛入边咧系所描述嘅。And we have to hear it very carefully. 我哋要非常咁小心去聆听。The process of hearing comes first. We hear nicely, and then we repeat. 咁所以咧，聆听系所呢个过程嘅开始啦。我哋好好咁去聆听啦，然之后再重复咁去聆听。Hmm, just like here, Srimad Bhagavatam, uh, Sukadeva Goswami heard Srimad Bhagavatam from his father Vyasadeva. 就好似咧聖典博加阿談咁樣啦 ，Sukadev Goswami 咧就係父親咧 ，Sri Vyasadev 嗰度咧聆聽聖典博加阿談。And Sri Vyasadev had been guided by Narada Muni。咁而 Sri Vya 誒 Sri 誒 Vyasadev 咧就係得到咧 Narada Muni 嘅指導。And and Vyasad 誒、uh, Narada Muni he had heard the knowledge from his father Brahma。咁而 Narada Muni 咧就係由佢父親咧主 Brahma 嗰度咧聆聽呢個知識。So in this way the knowledge was passed down through the disciplic succession。咁所以咧通過呢個師徒傳承咧呢個知識就一代一代咁樣傳落去。So Lord Krishna of course he comes into this world in order to establish the religious principles。咁主 Krishna 顯現咧就係重建呢一個宗教原則。In the Bhagavad Gita, Krishna says, "Sambhavan, Sambhavami, Atma Maya Ya, Atma Maya Ya." In other words, in every age, Krishna comes. 咁喺《布加梵歌》入边有 Krishna 就讲啦，喺每一个年代咧，佢都会显现。And he comes in different forms. 佢以不同嘅形象嚟到显现。He can even come in different species of life. 佢亦都以唔同嘅生命嘅品种嚟到显现。Right, we have the Matsya Avatar, the form, the Lord in the form of a fish. 我哋有 Matsya 呢个呢个化身啦，就系 Krishna 以一个鱼嘅形象显现。And we have Lord Varaha, the Lord. In the form of the pig. 咁我哋有瓦拉哈誒誒瓦拉瓦瓦瓦拉哈啦，咁咧就係 Krishna 咧就係一個紅豬嘅形象顯現。We have Lord Narasimha, half man, half lion. 咁我哋有 Narasimha Dev 啦，佢就係以半人半獅嘅形象嚟到顯現。So for the Supreme Lord, there is no restriction. He can come in any form. And he can combine forms. 对至尊主嚟讲咧，系冇任何嘅限制嘅，佢可以任何嘅形象显现，亦都可以一个两种唔同嘅生生物咧，系结合埋一齐嚟到显现，亦都可以。Just like Lord Narasimha combines the human form with the lion form. 就好似咧，主神 Shiva Dev 咧，佢就系结合咗人同埋狮子嘅形象。Sometimes we see like this. Sometimes you see mermaids. <laughs> 有時我哋會見到美人魚啊。Right, you see the the the, the young lady <laughs> with the long hair, and she's in the body of a fish. 咁咧一個好漂亮嘅女孩子啦，有長頭髮啦，但係咧佢係喺一個魚嘅身體嗰度。And so in the same way, the Supreme Lord, he can appear in many 
countless numbers of different forms。咁所以咧，至尊主亦都可以以咧系无数数之不尽嘅形象咧嚟到系显现。And similarly, his devotees also come in different places and in different forms。咁而佢嘅奉献者都一样咧，系喺唔同嘅地方啦，唔同嘅形象咧嚟到出现。There are great devotees in the animal bodies。咁咧有一个非常之伟大嘅奉献者咧，佢系以动物嘅形象出现。h a n u m a n is the monkey。咁咧就系 Hanuman 啦，佢就系一只马骝嚟嘅。And Garuda is a bird。Garuda 咧系一只鸟。Krishna s h e t r a Maharaj is writing a book about animals。咁咧 Krishna s h e t r a Maharaj 咧就写紧一本书，系关于动物嘅书。About the ethics which animals follow。咁咧就系诶，我哋对动物嘅呢一个嘅道德标准。嗯。In human life, we are also supposed to be ethical。咁咧，又就算系一个人一个人啦，都应该咧系有呢个遵守呢个道德嘅标准。But we come in this world in the Kali Yuga, and we're very unethical. We're very fallen。咁但系我哋喺卡利年代以人。嘅形象出現啦，但我哋就變得非常之冇道德啦，亦都咧係非常之墮落。So Lord Krishna came into this world to establish the principles of religion。咁所以主 Krishna 佢顯現咧嚟到重建呢一個宗教原則。And he spoke Bhagavad Gita and he said everyone should surrender to him。咁佢亦都講述咗聖典，誒講述咗《薄伽梵歌》，亦都係咧。叫所有人咧都要臣服於於佢。He said, "I will protect you if you surrender to me." 如果你臣服於我嘅話咧，我會保護你。But he didn't show how to do it. 但係並冇教我哋點樣去做。Therefore, five hundred years ago, Krishna came again as Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. 咁、嗯、所以咧，五百年前咧，主彩爺再次顯現，可以主彩彩爺媽爸爸嘅形象顯現。Here we see Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. 咁我哋喺壁畫上面就會見到主彩彩爺。And Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is telling every, showing everyone how a surrendered devotee. behaves。咁咧，主要單人媽爸爸係親自教導我哋咧，一個真正臣服於 Krishna 嘅奉獻者係點樣，應該點樣去做。That he is chanting the holy name。佢咧唸誦聖名。And he is delivering the fallen souls。佢咧係將呢啲墮落嘅靈魂咧係賜解決俾佢哋。He is awakening the Krishna consciousness in the hearts of people。佢咧喚醒人心中沉睡嘅 Krishna 知覺。So Srila Prabhupada says here, in the Kali Yuga, the people are more like animals than than humans. 咁所以喺呢個要知入邊啲聖爸爸講咧，喺卡年代咧，人咧就就好似動物咁樣，唔似人嘅，其實係動物。And they don't have any real spiritual knowledge. 佢哋咧冇真正誒冇任何真正嘅靈性知識。And they cannot see anything beyond their own sense gratification. 佢除咗係誒。有對佢哋自己嘅感官享樂有興趣之外咧，其他所有嘢佢都唔關心。They think their life is a great success if they're able to make some money。如果佢哋能夠賺到啲錢咧，佢就覺得人生咧就係一個好大嘅成功。But they don't know how to use the money properly。但係唔知道咧點樣正確咁運用呢啲金錢。They will use it to drink alcohol and to do so many. Sinful activities. 佢哋會用呢啲錢去飲酒啦，做好多各式各樣嘅罪惡嘅活動。嗯 ，they go to Macau, go to the casino. 佢哋會去澳門啦，去賭場賭錢。嗯 ，nobody ever wins there, but everybody goes there. 從來嗰從來冇有呢個人咧可以喺澳門啲賭場度贏錢嘅，但係唔知點解所有人都要去嗰度。Everybody is thinking, I will win. 每一個人咧都喺度諗，我咧係會贏嘅，會賺錢嘅。But everybody loses。但係最終咧，每一個人咧都係輸錢。So like this, people risk their life。咁所以咧，其實啲人咧係冒誒冒住生命危嘅危險。And they they risk losing the human form of life and becoming the animal。佢哋咧冒住咧係會喪失。成為一個人嘅呢一個嘅危險啦，再去再投生嘅時候咧，可能會成為動物。So it's very, we're very fortunate to get the human form of life。我哋非常幸運可以能夠咧得到人嘅呢一個嘅形象。But we need to 
we need to have the vision, we need to see the, the, the purpose of life. 但我們有這個軟件, so we are in the this age is a it's darkness. So we're like blind people. We do not see the real purpose of life. 在這個年代就是, but books like the Srimad Bhagavatam are there to guide us. 咁, 但是呢, and Prabhupada said, just by reading Srimad Bhagavatam, one day you will see Krishna on the pages of the Bhagavatam. Okay, any question? Yes. Need your one tea? Hurry, Bo. The question is, uh, within our param, uh, parampara, there are many um, many teachers, they are giving class, but they are not within ISKCON. Should we listen to these classes? Where are they giving class? Internet, on the internet. Well, it's not a very good idea. You have to hear from Srila Prabhupada first. You hear from Srila Prabhupada and Srila Prabhupada's followers. And then after you've heard from them, then you can be more flexible and you can once you know the basic philosophy. Then it's all. Then it's safer. Um. 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 Mm. Well, it's, there are differences. If you go and hear from these people, then you can get misled. So it's not recommended. There are so many people in ISKCON speaking. Jalang is giving class every day. Right, you were hearing Jalangi. Yesterday I saw she was hearing Jalangi's class. So there are many people speaking. It's not a very good idea to go away for to go and hear from other people. Even though they may say, no, we are the same sampradaya. But they're not following Prabhupada. We're following Prabhupada. So if you go and hear from other people, it means you're not keeping your faith in Prabhupada. So you can get some wrong ideas.
我们历史上没有翻译，但是、嗯、呃，像这些《使徒传奇》中这些呃林奇同学，他们的翻译，他他们有讲的这个呃有中文的，我我就想多听一些 Krishna 的消息。She she said because there are many books within the Sampradaya, but、uh, it's not translated, and、uh, from from this source she can read more. And some some of these books are translated into Chinese, and she can read more about Krishna through these books. They are within the same Sampradaya, but、uh, have you read all of Prabhupada's books? The 你读晒所有圣帕帕的书未咧？你读了所有的帕帕的书没？好有没有？ So you have, <laughs> you have no right to go and read other people. So you 暂时未有呢一个诶，暂时系唔准许去读其他书，因为你都未读完圣帕帕嘅书。You first read Prabhupada's books. 咁首先我哋要阅读圣帕帕嘅书。Everything, everything you need to know is there in Prabhupada's book. 因为咧，你所有需要知道嘅知识咧，已经喺圣帕帕书入边揾到。And we've translated them for to you. 嗯，因為亦都係已經係翻譯咗到中文嘅啦。You cannot say not Chinese. There's we have so many Chinese books.、嗯、因為而家咧已經有好多好多誒，包括啲書咧已經係翻譯咗到中文。So you read first Srimad Bhagavatam, twelve canto. 咁所以首先咧，我就要讀聖典部加拿談第十二篇。And then you read Chaitanya Charitamrita。一至十二篇啦，跟住咧就係讀永恆的主宰坦耶經。You don't need to read anything else。咁咧，誒暫時就唔應該讀其他所有任何嘢。Everything is there。所有嘢咧都喺呢啲書入邊。These books, Bhagavad Gita, Srimad Bhagavatam, Chaitanya Charitamrita。嗯。誒就係呢啲書，就係包括係誒《薄伽梵歌》啦，誒《永恆》誒《聖經》《薄伽梵歌》啦，同埋咧《永恆的主愛坦耶經》。So just read those books。咁首先就係要讀呢啲書先。After you've read all of Prabhupada's books, then we'll see if you need。咁如果你讀曬《聖伯伯》呢啲所有書之後咧，就可以再睇啦。你需唔需要再去讀其他書咧？ Yeah. Okay. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Shri Mad Bhagavatam ki. Jai. Shri Prabhupada ki. Jai.